So, is it finally going to happen today? The rally, what we've been waiting since couple of days, is it finally going to happen today? Because the price right now is approaching around some very, very interesting line of resistance and we are aware and also prepared if this resistance here in the media short term gets broken, then we are expecting the price of Bitcoin to continue this Christmas rally before it chooses a trend direction. So that's why we are going to talk about some very interesting scenario for the media short term for the upcoming days. So please watch this video till the end. And also before jumping into the content, guys, please try that like button if you haven't done it yet. And for those individuals watching this the first time, hit the subscribe button and the bell now starting this year in a daily time frame i am going to keep it very simple yesterday we talked about this williams alligator indicator and we have found out since the price right now is flashing a sell signal because this williams alligator indicator is showing us a bearish crossover bearish crossover when this blue line starts appearing at the top green line at the bottom and in the past price action we have found out whenever that has happened and also the indicators here to the downside like macd rsi t3cc has confirmed the movement we have seen a price retracement and this is exactly what is also being flashed but we know in the media short term even though this here is a bearish crossover we could still see some sort of a rally here like this some fake out price approaching around the 17,600 17,500 range before it chooses a train duration like this and why am i telling you that because if we look at this price structure here using this crypto anu buy sell indicator and so-called a diamond bottom we are getting a very very interesting signal because this line where we are approaching right now is the upper line resistance from this diamond bottom as you can see and also the resistance from this crypto anu buy sell indicator around 17,000 area yes guys if the price in the media short term manages to flip this resistance which you have around 17,000 into proper support then i am actually expecting the price of bitcoin to continue this uptrend here like this yes the price could be getting attracted towards this 17,500 17,600 before it chooses a train duration here like this because we know this exact line is also rejecting the price again and again so what we want here in the media short term price to overcome the resistance here right and also continue this uptrend forming so-called descending broadening wedge which is also unfolding right now here in the hourly time frame yes guys the price since it's approaching this key line of resistance what we want here in the media short term we want the price of bitcoin to continue this uptrend as soon as this key line of resistance around 17,000 gets broken because in an hourly time frame this here is considered as a bullish scenario bullish scenario when we flip the upper line resistance into proper support so what i'm trying to show you here is that in the media short term 17,000 is actually a very very important line of resistance which you have to overcome if we want to continue this uptrend and the reason why this descending broadening wedge is so important for us in the media short term because if you look at this here in a four hour time frame also using a descending broadening wedge formation type of scenario first what i need i need a ascending channel because inside this ascending channel the price is flashing us interesting movement each and every time we got attracted to a stopper line area we got rejected each and every time the lower line got tested we found a very nice support but what i'm going to do here i am going to add this so-called a descending broadening wedge type of formation once the price right once the price broke out of this key line of resistance the upper line area from the descending broadening wedge what happened we got attracted to us the top of this a sending channel yes guys this ascending channel upper line attracted the price and only after reaching around this upper line area we started showing this range bound and also got attracted towards the lower line area and in the past price action we have found out finding support at this lower line area has resulted in some really nice relief rally type of movement so if this is going to be another relief rally type of scenario then in the media short term we want the price of bitcoin to break out of this resistance line the upper line resistance which you have around 16,900 to 17,000 and flip that into support because if we do that right if we do that then this trend could also continue uptrend like this yes guys the price of bitcoin could be getting attracted towards the upper line area before right before getting attracted towards the next area of confluence and that 
could bring the price around 17,500 to 17,600 range. Let me show you that here. So guys, now before we talk about this broadening wage, before we talk about this inverse head and shoulder type of scenario, which is unfolding right now for Bitcoin, please destroy that like button if you haven't done it yet. And for those individuals watching this for the first time, hit the subscribe button and the bell. So now if you look at this price structure here like this, what I want to show you, if we if we do overcome the resistance, which you have around 17,000 here in the medium short term, could trigger another movement, which could bring the price of Bitcoin around 17,500, 17,600 range. And if that is going to happen, then we are also going to break the resistance. Yes, guys, the resistance from this inverse head and shoulder and also resistance from this broadening wedge, the upper line area. And that, right, that could result in another movement which could bring us around 17,500, 17,600 for the upcoming days. So that's why our focus in the media short term is going to be around 17,000. And if we do manage to break that 17,000 into proper support, then we are expecting this trend to continue at least towards 17,500, 17,600 before choosing a trend duration. And not just only because of this, but also if we use this A sending channel formation, here, you know, for our time frame, we have found out the price has broken the key line of support. But if we do overcome the resistance, what we have here in the media short term, then we are expecting the price of Bitcoin to continue this uptrend at least at least towards the lower line area from this ascending channel before choosing a trend duration. Why? Because this exact line here in the past price action was acting as a strong line of support. And this is exactly where we could be getting gravitated before it chooses a trend duration. So that's why, God, that's why even this one scenario is clearly pointing us 17,500, 17,600 could be on the line if we manage to find proper support above 17,000 area because we know if we fail right now, let's look at this scenario which indicates if it fails to continue this uptrend, if it fails to break out of this 17,000 resistance here in the medium short term, then we have to be extremely careful because this here is so-called head and shoulder. Yes, guys, this here is a bearish continuation pattern and once the price once the price forms this proper right shoulder and also get attracted towards this neckline area, we have to be extremely careful because once we lose the support, we could be starting another sell off, which could bring the price below 15,000 range. So that's why please be careful and let's hope that this 15,000 resistance, sorry, 17,000 resistance in the media short term gets broken and also flipped into proper support because by doing that, we are going to turn the price of Bitcoin bullish for the media short term and that could result in some really friendly type of scenario. So these were some of the quick updates that I wanted to share with you in today's video. If you enjoyed my work, then please destroy that like button. And for those individuals watching this for the first time, hit the subscribe button and the bell. Now, by saying this, I'm signing out. My name is Anup. Bye-bye.